Concerning a Salafi, I think this is a really important question. It's a good question. It's what we have been trying to call to, inshallah, in the community here in Edmonton. And a Salafi is just simply trying to practice Islam, understand Islam, the Quran and the Sunnah, the way the companions did, the Salaf, and the second generation after them, and the third generation. It's not a group, it's not a club, it doesn't have any ra'is, any amir, any mudir. You don't have to be a, with a group of people who call themselves Salafi and you have to be with them. You don't have to write across your thobe Salafi. You don't have to have a jacket that says I'm Salafi. You don't have to walk down the street with a big drum saying I'm Salafi, Salafi. Salafi is simply taking that Quran and the authentic Sunnah and understanding them and practicing them the way those companions did. Everything that you do, everything that you say, everything that you believe, the way you worship, the way you celebrate, you can always reference all of that stuff back to what those companions were doing. And that's what the Imams of Al-Islam were upon, and that's what we hope Masjid al-Sahaba are trying to do, and the other masajid in this area. Every Muslim group and organization is going to say, I believe in the Quran and the Sunnah. That's not enough. Because people say they believe in the Quran and Sunnah, some of them curse Abu Bakr and Uthman. Some of them say that Ali ibn Abi Talib didn't die, he's from the nur of Allah and all of that. Some people say, I believe in the Quran and Sunnah, and they take that Quran and the Sunnah, and because they don't like someone here, they'll blow us all up to kill that one person. And he said, I believe in the Quran and Sunnah. Whereas, if the person is trying to be on Salafiya, it's just simply the Quran and the Sunnah, the way those companions understood the Quran and the Sunnah. And there are many proofs for that. And Allah knows best.